Hello from Celadon Lotus. Today we're going to be making a paper rose and this is out of tissue paper. These are the supplies that we're going to be using. This is about eight and a half by 11 sheet of tissue paper, a pipe cleaner, paper of your choosing. This I'm going to use for the leaves, which is why it's green. These are just the tools I like to use. Exacto blade, a Q-tips are handy for blotting up a little bit of glue, Q-tips, your favorite glue and your favorite scissors. So let's get started. The tissue paper is very simple. It's just cutting the tissue paper, starting out in a circle. It doesn't have to be an exact circle. It doesn't have to be perfect. Just the circle that you put your heart into. There we go. This aside, and in the circle, we're simply going to cut a spiral shape. Now what we're going to do is we're going to take our pipe cleaner and put it on the inside of the rows. I like putting my pipe cleaner in this direction because that way when you roll your rows you're going to be rolling the petals so that they're out so that they're facing out instead of facing in i like the shape of it of course you can do whatever shape you like because nature is can be very amorphic so we're putting a bead of glue here to secure it and get it going and then we just simply roll our rows. While the rose is drying for a few minutes, I'm going to put it aside. Take out our piece of paper. This is about a quarter of the eight and a half by 11 sheet. Fold it in half. Fold it in half again. Snip off a tiny corner. And I'm going to cut a leaf shape out of it. And then you just cut off the excess that you're not using. This will be the section that the stem goes through. Okay. Hold this. Take our flower. Now this glue will dry clear. And put a couple dabs of glue around here. You can take off your, your Q-tip and just, this glue will dry clear. And it will dry clear in the center as well. It's white right now, but it will dry clear. And here you go. A very, very simple rows out of tissue paper. If you like, you can curl back the edges or you can leave them natural. Well, everybody, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching. For more reviews, how-to, and creative project idea videos, Please subscribe to our YouTube channel and like us on social media.